The UH Rainbow Warrior football team plays its first home game on Saturday. Nikki Shenfeld stopped by Aloha Stadium and found out about some new stadium policies. After a big win last week in Colorado, the Bows will face off at home against Navy at 5 o'clock on Saturday. Aloha Stadium workers say they're expecting a big crowd and with that, a new policy in hopes of speeding up the lines. So this season we're limiting fans to one bag, which is 12 inches by 6 inches by 12 inches. Uh, at all of our gates we'll have these handy little boxes, so if your bag fits in the box, um, then it's, you can bring it in. He says anything bigger will have to be taken back to your car, so plan accordingly. You need probably want to put that out close to the parking lot, so that if it doesn't fit, you have to be able to walk back to your car, so they're coming all the way back here and go right over back. That's, that's a big parking lot. It is. <laughs> Fans can carry items like a jacket, seat cushion, and blanket into the stadium with their bag. Another new policy, strollers must fall down and fit under the seat. It's not only for safety, but it's also to get fans in uh, more quickly through the gates. Obviously, with fewer bags, there's fewer bags to check. These drawstring bags fit perfectly inside of these boxes. Now, for my bag, a little too big to fit into the box. Therefore, I have to take out my makeup bag and my purse. Now, I would be allowed inside of Aloha Stadium. Andrew says the stadium is long overdue on a bag policy. Five years ago, the NFL created bag policies at all its stadiums. Some have a clear bag policy, while others don't allow one at all, including a purse. Andrew says parking lots will open at noon, and as always, expect traffic and plan your route ahead of time. From Aloha Stadium, Nikki Schoenfeld, KHON2 News.